In this video, I'll do a versus of Llama 3 versus ChatGPT. Now, in a previous video, I walked you through how you can download and use Llama 3 locally on your computer. But today, I want to do just a quick, simple, ex uh, more or less example of how Llama 3 compares to ChatGPT. And I'm using ChatGPT 3.5, it's a free version. So probably a version for the paid version works much better as compared to Llama 3. But let's just put Llama 3 versus ChatGPT uh, and see what, what, what goes on. Now, I have Olama running and I'm just going to pull up command prompt and just run Olama run Llama 3. So Llama 3 is ready to run and I'm just actually just going to begin by saying something like uh, now on ChatGPT how many countries are in Africa? Just a simple question. And let's see the response. The response is there are 54 recognized countries in Africa. Now we're going to run or more or less ask Lama 3 the same question. How many countries are in Africa? So there's more or less like a difference. Uh, we're getting a, a list of all the recognized countries in Africa, which is a more detailed uh, kind of response that you would like to see. Maybe in the paid versions of ChatGPT, you get that. But in Llama 3, an open source, locally run uh, large language model, you can get all this information for free. So how many countries are in Africa? There are 54 recognized countries, sovereign states in the African continent. These countries are. I kind of like the response I get from Llama 3 as compared to uh, what uh, we have with uh, ChatGPT 3.5. This is a free version. I'm assuming the paid version has better uh, responses, but I'm not sure. Let's do another one. Let's say something like translate uh, into Swahili. Good morning. Presenter. So the translation of good morning in Swahili is Asubuhi Njema. Here's a breakdown of the phrases. Asubuhi means morning. Njema means good. So Asubuhi Njema literally means good morning. How cool is that? It's really, really awesome to see this from a locally run large language model. Now, let's ask ChatGPT 3.5 the same question. Hmm. Good morning translates to good morning in Swahili. Swahili, like many languages, uses the same phrase for good morning. Jesus Christ, this is wrong. Because what Lama 3 gives me here is the correct answer. Uh, well, I don't know how it's varying on, but let's see if we can use some prompts uh, right here. Uh, let's say plan a tour for architectural photography. Uh, let's say compare business strategies. Hmm. Now you see, when it comes to uh, more or less ChatGPT, if you give it more or less the pre uh, mid prompts, it's going to give you a better response. Uh, and probably if you did the same, if I did the same for this, I'm going to run the same prompt and let's see the response that we actually get. Hmm. It's doing the same thing, more or less because it's in the command prompt window. Uh, we may not get a more refined look like we have here, but we can see aspect uh, budget strategy, luxury strategy. For this one, we have aspect budget to luxury, luxury to budget. Uh, different things, target market. Hmm. Yep. It's more or less uh, a good way of actually comparing these two, Llama 3 uh, versus ChatGPT. And this is three, ChatGPT 3.5. But you see, as much as Llama 3 is run on command prompt, uh, it's actually giving us a very good and what can I say? A defined 
way of actually answering some of the questions or the prompts that we actually uh, put in here and kind of has more meat if i may say for example shifting from budget to luxury focus on upgrading product we don't see this right inside here shifting from luxury to budget down a very detailed response so i'd kind of say that llama 3 shines uh versus chat gpt 3.5 maybe unless somebody else uh, tested via the paid versions maybe we'll get to know how it runs and fares on uh, but for llama 3 to be run locally and give us such responses is a really good way to actually give it a thumbs up uh chat gpt maybe the paid version is a thumbs up as well but i can say that llama 3 is actually going to compete competitively with chat gpt or other uh, more or less large language models out there so uh, hopefully this video gives you a clue of how llama 3 fares versus chat gpt 3.5 thanks for watching this video until next time stay safe and never stop learning